Yes, this video is for um, the bro calling some Lord of Lemon on social media. Lord of Lemon. Okay, before I continue, let me play the video. Well, he did a video where he was complaining about the blogger, that, uh, about uh, what offense has he commit. But um, I want to react to it. I want to react to it, but let me, before, before I go far, let me just play the video. Let me play the voice so I can hear the voice then now. After that video, then I will say something about it. Let's listen to it. I will repeat what I said in this particular video that is going viral. I will repeat it again. I said I have not you know, done you know, Hey, Jesus! What you guys problem? On the don't see me say I come online, yeah, talk say, yeah. oh, I they do um, 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 reception where you know, or I carry, I carry my wife go 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 church. On I hear anything from my mouth like that, for crying out loud, if you have retentive memory, if you have brain, I said I did court wedding with my woman. That is the only thing I said. I did court wedding and traditional marriage with my woman. So which one now can be say, um, I don't say, uh, I know marry my wife. You guys, for me, I just feel that you guys want to spoil somebody's family. Because I see no reason why you guys are, 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 are scattering all these things. I see no reason why you guys are just changing topic. Most of you guys, I'm talking about some Nigerian bloggers, you guys don't have sense. There's some things you blog and there's some things you don't blog. Now, where I take come outside now, I want, to, I want to see the evidence. Do you have any evidence? Do you have any proof? I need to see the proof. Where I take come outside, come outside, I say, um, I do wedding. I do wife's wedding. For crying out loud, you guys know me. If I should do my wife's wedding, you guys, imagine my birthday day like this. Those, are, those that have brain, they should think it. Imagine say, my birthday was like this. My birthday was viral. It went viral. Imagine, to, imagine it was like this. Then talk more about the wedding. It's going to be a shutdown. Total shutdown. Now, how about the wedding now? You don't go, you don't go, like, you don't go trend. You don't go, go everywhere. You know, social media, no carry on. And you guys are saying, you guys are, on a dozen, you guys are just hungry. You guys are just hungry. Yes, I said what I said. Because... Don't be any smart when we say I don't know. Can't okay, use do video now. It's not necessary. I need my privacy. Yes, it's not every little thing I do. You will use and do video. You will use and do. You will talk, 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 talk. On I know they tire. On I know they tire. Joy, I did not do anything like wedding. I only do intro and I paid a bride price. I have not done anything wedding. I never carry any woman go church. I never throw party for any woman to say yes to the two wedding. Did you see me wear any? And okay, yes, our court marriage. Where but to the two wedding. Did you see me wear any? And okay, yes, our court marriage. Whereby she walk out. Now that kind of guy, they do they do they do wedding. Now that kind of gown. They tell they used to do wedding, reception wedding. Can't you see the kind of girl she wore? You guys are just you guys are, you guys are just confusing somebody. You guys, you guys know how to Jesus Christ. Imagine how the video is is trending. Top one on Facebook. Top one. The video was so viral, everybody was posting it, saying all sorts of things. Because why you want to make your money? Come on, cut me some slack. Don't don't use your own to spoil another person's own. It does not make any sense. It does not make any sense. Did you see me ever, ever, ever in my life said, okay, oh, we did big wedding? No. This is a woman I love so much. This is a woman I can I can I love her so much. I don't use her to joke. That was then, no. I'm not. I'm not saying this thing to. That was then, because now is won't trust all of us. Now all of us they won't trust her like this.
Right now, the woman, I'm telling you, that was then. This is a woman I love so much. I love her so much. Before this saga started. I cannot tell her for anything. How many men they do court marriage? But that was the first. Yeah, I think that was the second thing I did. Immediately. Because why? True love. True love. I could remember when, when, when a lot of my friends said, bro, don't do this thing, don't do this thing, it's too much. Calm down, yeah, small, small, even if you want to, no rush, do I? I said, no, I love this gay. I have to do this court marriage. You're doing court marriage with your partner. It shows that, yes, she is the only one. It shows that, yes, she is what? The only one. So right now, what's happening? She left me. She went to get me to another person. And now she's back. And somebody's already in the house. Simple story. She left me to go see another person. And now she's back. Somebody's already in the house. What offense did I commit? What's the offense? Who got the offense? I want to know. I rush go to court marriage because of love. If not be love, nothing will push me wrong go to court marriage. I just have to make this video. Nothing. Absolutely nothing will ever. Now, it's kind of a lesson to me. I won't say I want to rush and, uh, or probably for divorce, I will not rush and get married and that person do cut my. I will never try it. Now they talk, you and your family, they drag property with me. Go, you say no. You left before. You say my uncle pursue you. My uncle pursue you, yeah, go now. You don't want to go. You're looking for paperwork that they will sign and what and you will take property come on for crying out loud did you work for me did you did have you ever sent me like a million naira in my account before so why all this mm. why stop making stop telling the world stop making them stop making them see me as a bad person where i am not I don't say you need the right time for face. I am not. You can see the kind of people that came to the to my birthday, the, my celebration day. You can see it. How they I was I, I am really proud of them. If I am a bad person, who want, who want the near bad person? Who want the follow bad person to talk? Who want to interact with bad person? Oh, oh no, I am not. I'm not bragging. It's not coming from a place of pride. I'm not. That is just a fact. The simple truth. Yes. And it may be, just let, me, let, me, let me pause it here because uh, the video is long. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to play the. I can make the video finish. But I don't want to be long with this uh, video. It's going to be a short video. I just want to let this young man know what he doesn't know. We said, uh, what is, uh, what is uh, his own offense? The people are blaming him. Yeah, we have a lot of blame. I need to blame yourself, Lord of Lemon. Now, you are legally married to your wife, Mary. You prank Mary first, and Mary prank you back. That's the beginning of this your problem. And Mary prank you back, you turn into another thing. You never forgive her. Yes, Mary made a mistake. When you a young girl, how does Mary? And how, how old are you too? I believe two of you are not even ripe enough to get married. 
but maybe because of the small change you have in your mind, that's why you're running to marry. That two of you are just not matured for marriage. Mary, we said Mary, maybe Mary uh, went out or he met the former boyfriend on, um, in, in, in the restaurant, which he's not supposed to do. do. She's not supposed to go there. She doesn't have the right to go and meet her former boyfriend. But it's a public place. And when you get to know, she apologized. She kneeled down and begged you. Since then, you never forgive her. Two of you started having a problem in the house. She begged, 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 and she apologized to you, but you never accept apology. Every day, quarreling in the house with a prank. She, she, with the prank. And she begged you, but you were the first person to prank her. And she pranked you back, you turned into another thing. Remember, I don't know what to call you. Maybe a prank star, a, 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 a prank star or a content creator. I don't even know the name to call you. Or a blogger. I don't know the one you belong to, but I believe you belong to all of them. Because you do prank, you do blog, and you, are, you do a content creator, you are a content creator too. So, I don't know why you said um, a lot of um, bloggers, they are talking about you on social media, they put everything about you and your family on social media. Lord of Lemon, how do you make your name? How do you know your name? It's true to share media. I can say maybe I, I think you are if 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 I should qualify you or we qualify you as um as a social media reality star. Yeah, I will call. I will call. I will call, I will call you a social media reality star. So she know anything, everything about you. Have to come to your media. You are no more. You can't say you want your privacy. No way. You can't hide anything for public anymore. You cannot hide anything from public anymore. Because you made your name there. And you are a social media reality star. That's where you made your name. So you don't have privacy anymore. Once you put yourself on social media, and you made your money there, and that, that's where you belong to, so you cannot say you want your privacy. You can't. Like me now, I cannot say... I uh, need one privacy. No way. Once I have put my face on social media, I'm a blogger, I'm a speaker on social media. So I cannot say I want my privacy anymore. If you don't want that, keep away from social media. If you don't want that, you have to keep away from social media. And part of your, uh, part of your two wife, <laughs> by your two wife, your wife Mary, the first your your wife gone 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 Mary that you marry in the, in court because you did the court wedding. You say you didn't go to church, yes, but the court one is which one is legal? Is the court one? So you are still legally married to Mary before you go and do another traditional marriage to another lady. 
You commit offense here. Yeah. We don't know. If Mary is not, look, you said Mary working from the Mary is not working from the house. It's your brother or your uncle who said when the when the when two of you are having problem in the house, who told Mary then, I remember very well, said Mary should vacate her for some time. Maybe your mind will come down or maybe after some time. Everything will set you. Mary don't leave the house like that. It's for all of you are so okay, Mary should vacate the house for some time. Which I said on my one of my videos that that your brother is only a good brother or your uncle is only a good uh, it's only a good uncle. Why can you say somebody's wife to move away from the house for some time? So to say for them. That's how Mary left the house for some maybe weeks that time. Immediately you go and bring another woman into the same house when you have not divorced the first one. You've committed offense there, you don't know. You cause it yourself. And you said you love Mary before, but now you don't love Mary anymore. So if you don't love somebody and you don't want to forgive her, why what what are you supposed to do? Go back to that court, file, go and file the divorce. Go and file the divorce. You refuse to file the divorce. You say she just go away. You have to go to that court to go and file, file for the divorce. So you say you can divorce her, and you go, so you need to marry your your friend, um, uh, wife. But you refuse to do that. You say she just go away from your house. Just go away from your house. Who does that? You cannot just send her away like that, and she won't go away like that. You have to sign a paper, you have to go to back to court where you did the first one and go and do the divorce there. So why are you scared to go to court? You are shouting every day. They should go, they should go, they should go. You don't love somebody and you don't want to, you don't, you don't want to do the right thing. You don't want that in your life anymore. It's joy that you want. You are free to marry the joy you want, but do the right thing. Divorce this lady. Go to court. Do the right thing. Why are you afraid? You know the implication. That's why you are afraid. You are scared to do that. Because you have already committed offense. You can go to jail for all you did. You don't know. You don't know. You see, by shouting on social media every day, crying like a baby, if you don't know you are a baby. Because you don't know the law. Only you are just scared. But if you know the law, you will not even try it at all at all. If you know the implication of what you have read. Because you will not even try it. You're going to bring another woman into the house when you have not divorced the first one. You have not divorced the first one. So... Mary, I don't know why what Mary is doing. Mary can do the right thing now. I will advise Mary to don't even pity you. Mary is still pitying you. You cannot work, you don't love her anymore. Mary fired five or divorce to take you to court. Go to court. You know. Because that's why you're scared. But Mary is still maybe passionate, still pitying you that maybe, but nothing can come out. I don't know why Mary is still waiting. Nothing will come out. If Lemon refuses to do it, do and do it yourself. Get your lawyer to write this boy. The guy says, I has money. Why so? Why is he scared of signing the first letter? If you see you are short and you have money, yeah, I just bought a mansion, bought a mansion. Well, I mean, what kind of woman be now you? Now, you nail yourself again now. You are seeing the marriage. You haven't divorced Mary. You bought nice mansion for Mary. You are Mary, you don't know what she's seeing in the marriage. If anything happened today, Mary is going to have 
part of God is just God now. Or she's in the marriage. So if you know you don't want Mary, why don't you do it in time before you go and buy this nail? It's God that wants to cash you. Because you are you say you are no you are wicked. If you are no wicked, you are wicked. The young lady made a mistake and she begged you, she apologized, but you refused. You turn her to a monster to say she don't like the way she's talking to you. Oh, of course. She already said that you don't love her. And the way you talk to her, you don't like it. What do you expect? What respect do you want from her? Somebody you don't respect. You want that to respect you. You turn you turn her to be a monster. So you don't know. She never she was never like that before. That's why she give you back. You have no respect. I can still respect you. You don't do you respect her. If you respect her, you won't go and bring another woman into the house. You will not go and bring an, another woman into the house. So you never respect her. That, well, well, you, you respect her to, 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 to respect you. She can never respect you. Because she knows that you don't respect her. So you are, you are the one who turned me to what she is today. You are the one. I know you don't like the way she talks to you. You will talk back. What do you, what do you say from her? She will talk back. For you to go and you have the audacity when you are sitting legally married to somebody. When you are the one who forced her out, who forced her out of that um, building before. If you know you don't even want to marry somebody else, you, you, you can marry that one outside, keep her there till you finish. Uh, but uh, you finish about your divorce, uh, something. If you know you don't want Mary back anymore, you cannot forgive her. You should have rent a partner for the one you love now. You can keep her there till you finish your secretly. No, you will not even know anything about it. Secretly. Till you finish what you want to do. But because God wants to, God, God want to put you in shame. That's why. That's why you don't know what you are doing. But you know, God, God knows that you are trying to shoot this lady. That's why everything is exposed. You don't even know what you are doing before you go and do it. If you have sense, you will not even, never, you will never bring another woman to that house. Because you are still legally married to that, the first one. Before you take her to court, don't you know the implication? If you know the implication, why do you rush? If you know the implication, somebody offend you, and you offend that too. You don't want to, you don't want to forgive, you don't want to forgive her. She never sleep with that guy. She just met the former one at the at restaurant, which is very wrong for her to do. And she apologized, she begged you. You don't have sense. That's why she go there because she's a strong girl. She's a strong girl. And she immediately she realized that she begged you that what okay, I'm not going to go down and meet this my former one on the, in the restaurant. And she apologized, she, she knelt down and begged you. She knelt down and begged you. But you will never forgive her. You will never, you will never forgive her. If you don't like her, you, you said in the video, say you love her before, but you don't love her anymore. So what are you still doing with her? Somebody you don't love anymore, what are you still doing with her? Why don't you do the right thing? Do the right thing. Fire a divorce. Let her go on separate way. And you can do your own thing. But you refuse. You say she should just, she should just walk away. From the marriage like that. Hmm? You say you don't know the offense you've committed. You've committed offense, you don't know. So you think money is everything. You see money, you think money is everything. You think fame is everything. You are no wise at all at all. You are no wise at all at all. Lord of Lemo. And you are shouting uh, blogger. They are talking about you. 
they are pulling your matter into the social media and the video. Of course, they will, they will use you to be making money on social media. But that's where you make your own money too. You are a social media uh, reality star. So what do you expect? What privacy do you want? They are probably free go. If you, you say you are probably free go. You call yourself a public go. You say so. You say I'm a public go. I'm a public Yeah, you are probably go. True, true. You are probably go. Of course. So what do you expect from public go? How do you make this your name? True social media, social media. So better shut up your mouth and behave. All this shouting on Facebook cannot help you out. The length of manners. The length of manners. No, the right thing to do because you are just coming on live and make full of yourself. Small boy left. Small boy, how old are you? You are not 27 yet. You are living with a true woman. Are you not ashamed of yourself? You see, I have a long way to go. You see, you see, not, you see I'm not later than maybe, maybe 70 years to live in this, in this world. So what's, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? You think money is everything? You think the money is going to be like that forever? You think the answer is going to be like that forever? You think you are going to be like that forever? You can't be like that forever. So better sit down and think. Know what you want to do to your life. At your age, you are keeping two women in the house. At your age, how much do you have? How much do you have? How many investments do you have? Let alone lemon. Think, sit down, think. So you don't have any privacy. Forget about privacy. You are, you are probably figure. So you'll be seeing yourself on social media every day. Every day.